till I tell you, Ted. Funland's coming to Craggy Island. It'll be here Saturday. Oh, yes, this is the fairground thing. I'll, I wouldn't have much interest in that type of thing myself, to be honest. <laughs> They've got a spider baby. <laughs> a what? A spider baby. You know, it's kind of a freak show thing, you know? It's got the body of a spider, but it's actually a baby. And... <laughs> How is it a baby? Does it have a nappy on it or something? No. Well, um, does it have the head of a baby? Um, no. Well, if it looks like a spider and it doesn't actually gurgle at you or anything, how do you know it's actually a baby? They keep it in a pram. <laughs> Dougal, are you absolutely sure about this? You're not confusing it with the dream you had or anything? <laughs> no, honestly, I, I saw it on the news. Uh, honestly, I, I, oh, oh, wait now, actually. Now that you say it, it was a dream, yeah. <laughs> have you been studying this like I told you? Oh, I have, Ted, I have, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that, but we should go anyway, Ted. Come on, it'll be great. Uh, last year I had to go with the horse riding and it was just fantastic. I didn't know you could ride horses. <laughs> well, it wasn't a real horse, Ted, like... Uh... <laughs> It was this old fella with a saddle on him. <laughs> God, he, he must have been about 80, you know. <laughs> of course, he couldn't go very fast. Like, you know, I was kind of lashing him with the whip and all that. But <laughs> couldn't get much of a response out of him, you know. And uh, how long were you up on him? Oh, I'd say it was about... Uh, about an hour. Hey! Hey! Listen, this Baxter priest is in our spot. <laughs> we were just... Put the fork down. What? Oh, Put I wasn't got... Put the fork down. Now get your hands very slowly to your sides. Slowly. All right. I'm going to... Put the megaphone down now, all right? Now you need. Now, I'm going to reach inside my pocket, all right? Nice and slow. Everything's fine. Did you get it? To <laughs> be honest, I'm just going home. So, fuck off, you pedophile! All right, come on, come on, come on. Nothing to see here. Come on, back to the picnic. Nothing to see here. Dougal, aren't you uh, going to introduce me to your friend? Oh, this is uh, Father Demo. How are you? <laughs> Hello, Father. Playing the old computer game there? <laughs> Hello, Father Ted Crilly speaking. Yes, ah! <laughs> Father Frost, yes, yes, I'll tell him. Uh, Father Damien, uh, Father Frost says you're to go home, your tea is ready. <laughs> tell him I'm not going, I'm having dinner here. Oh, are you? <laughs> yeah, hello, Father. <laughs> uh, no, he's staying here for dinner. <laughs> um, uh, Father Damien, Father Frost said you're to go home immediately. Shy! Did you tell him I'm having dinner here? Uh, yes. Well, tell him to feck off then. <laughs> He's happy enough here for the moment, Father. <laughs> right. OK. Father Frost said if you don't come home now, he'll come down and get you. Yeah, tell him that's fine. I don't care what he does. He's not the boss of me. Right. <laughs> all right, all right. I'm going. Tell him I'm going. I'll see you, Dougal. You can just straighten that out with the top of a hammer. Have a look in that box over there. I didn't mean to do that. I'll just tap it the other way. It's no use, Ted. You'll never get it absolutely right. Quick! It's Bishop Jordan! I think he's dead! <laughs> there! Oh, Lord! Yeah. 
That's a dustbin, Mrs. Toad. <laughs> Terrible. Where's Richard Fax? We have to lose that sax solo. Oh, 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 there you are, Father. You wanted the official tour. Oh, God, yes. He's been talking about nothing else all day. Will you calm down, you little monkey man? Well, basically, these are the main controls. Over here, we have the gauges for engines one, two, and three. <laughs> Sorry, I was only asking if you'd ever been in a cockpit before. No, but I was on the bridge of a ceiling ferry once, and it was funny, but I was looking at the controls, and... Uh, <coughs> oh, uh, nothing happened at all. <laughs> Hello there, Father. Uh, hello, Colm. <laughs> Out and about. I am. Same as yourself. Good, good. I hear you're a racist now, Father. <laughs> what? What? How did you get interested in that type of thing? <laughs> Who said I'm a racist? Everyone's saying it, Father. Should we all be racist now? What's the official line the church is taking on this? Oh, no. Only the farm takes up most of the day, and at night I just like a cup of tea. I might be able to devote myself full-time to the old racism. Good for you, Father. What? Oh, Mrs. Carberry. <laughs> Good for you, Father. Well, someone had the guts to stand up to them at last, coming over here, taking our jobs and our women, and acting like they own a second place. Well done, Father. Good for you. Good for you. I like a second. Second Greeks. It isn't the Greeks, it's the Chinese he's after. I am not after the Chinese. I don't care. I am not a racist, all right? God. Fagging bricks! How's Mary? She's fine. She got that job after. Great! <laughs> Dougal! Dougal! Are you going over four miles an hour? I tell him, doing fine. Leave me alone. Are you doing over four? Not yet. <laughs> now I am. <laughs> Me. There's a bomb on the milk float. A bomb? Right. Who's that for? No, we're not supposed to deliver to anyone. It's going to go off and kill you. Pat Mustard put it there because I got him sacked. When you go under four miles an hour, it'll go off. The bomb will go off. Have you got that? Oh, God, help! I don't want to be a milk man anymore. You'll be safe as long as you don't slow down. Oh, Ted, look! It's a big bunch of boxes in the middle of the road. Just stay over four. 